Creo Parametric 7.0 introduces enhanced compliance to detailing standards. For a start, we have added additional indicator values for geometrical tolerances. These values correspond to the recent ISO 1101 standard. The enhanced compliance to the recent standards also contains some new symbols that were added to the symbol palette and an updated syntax checker logic. In reality, it might take a while until a company updates their tolerancing standard version to the latest. So we have added additional flexibility to allow choosing which standard version is going to be used by the syntax checker for your models or drawings. In this example, I am updating a GTOL with one of the new symbols. The syntax shows error because the tolerance in standard for this model is set to an older version. But once I choose to update it, I will no longer get this error. This recent standard version also have different requirements for the visible gap between the GTOL and the indicator frames. So you can control it with the new detail option GTOL indicator attached. Creo Parametric 7.0 also supports an updated syntax checker for the recent ASME Y14.5 standard. In this case, the recent version of the standard is no longer supports the use of concentric type of GTOLs. So it will be shown a syntax error for version 2018 of this standard, or as correct syntax if your tolerancing standard is set to the older version. And finally, if you have a composite geometrical tolerance with additional text attached, you can now evenly spread the text so it will be correctly aligned with the composite GTOL compartments.